Alright, so here we are back with this fan again, the ZI Cooler. Did some work on it off camera and discovered that it has a two-pole shaded pole motor with an open bearing in the back. So I drilled out the back a little bit so I can have easier access to the open bearing. I'll show you. And there you go. Uh, it's not the most professional, but what do I care? As long as I have easier access to the open bearing, as you can see right there. Now, yes, I did. I gave it oil. I gave it quite a bit of oil. That's what it was in need of. I almost got rid of this thing, but I said, you know what? I'm going to work with it. It has some information on it. Like it has an A and then it has a 4. I'm not sure what that is. An A and a 4. Some type of model number, a serial number or something on the motor. So there's that. It does have the open bearing and then, of course, around the around the shaft of the blade. The blade is a press fit, so it's easy to come off. And now it gets up to speed right away. I'll show you. I gave it so much oil. So here it goes. Let's go ahead and give it a go. There you go, right to speed. You guys should be able to hear the wind speed. It moves a lot of air. 28 watts. So for 28 watts, it's quite powerful. It is a rebranded Wuzu. has a deep pitch blade. Took that silly sticker off of it too. And it does oscillate, but I'm not gonna show it. I just wanna show you guys that now it's working and I got it back in service. Okay, the Holmes Honeywell version is over here. There it is right there. Because I put this back in service. This thing is moving a crap load of air. It wasn't doing it at first because the Chinese freak shows in China didn't give it enough oil. That's why it couldn't live up to its full potential. Now this thing is really throwing air like you should. Now I'm keeping this fan in the connection because it's doing its job. Not as powerful as far in terms of air movement as this one is. Or this one. But it is moving out of here because it has the deep pitch blade, the same blade that Wuzu uses. So it throws a lot of air. And there you go. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm going to show you the spin down time. The spin down time is drastically improved. Or should I say dramatically improved? Sorry, I'm tired, y'all forgive me. Last word didn't make no sense, but dramatically improved. You can see the spin down time is much better. It gets right up to speed, just like that. Whereas before, if you recall correctly, when I first got it, it was struggling to get up to speed. Any power, no power. Low is just a gentle breeze, kind of like with Jordan lights. You got medium, low power, 28 watts. Pretty strong because of the deep pitch blade. And once again, the spin down top for this light blade. That's about it. Remember, it wasn't slowing down like that before. It almost come to a quick stop. So, yeah, there you go. I'm going to put it back on as soon as I'm done with the video because I'm using it to pack in service. I got to let the oil kind of like settle in. I gave it quite a bit of oil. So, there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Did some improvements to it. Sorry that I didn't get it on camera. It took a lot of work to do that. But there you go. Lamont Fan Man and out.